This video is to answer one of the comments in uh, my VB6 numbers only in a text box video. Now the comment is from Try to Be Alive, and he says, "What is the VB key for the dot button?" So looking here, it says VB key decimal point. So he's asking how to make a decimal point. Um, how to make a decimal point with this code? So now we just go back to the code of this um, this video, which is right here, it's text one. So this code enables the numbers and disables the letters. So numbers, one, two, three. No numbers, no symbols, no dot, no nothing. So it's just numbers and the backspace. So this part is for the numbers and this is for the backspace. Okay. In order to enable the uh, in order to the, enable the decimal point you have to do you have to enable another key ASCII. In school I was taught to make it into a constant in the general declarations. So go anywhere up here and make sure it goes to general and declarations. So if you're, for instance, in text, you can go here to general and it'll go to straight to declarations. Now, just type in const for constant and it's vb deci point is equal to 46. So this is the way I was taught it in school. Okay, so or go back and going back to the code of the exclusive number, exclusive to numbers only. So or key ASCII equal to VB deci point. So let's see. I forgot the space. Okay. So all we did there we just added an or key ASCII is equal to VB deci point. The VB deci point here being the value of the VB deci point here. So the VB, VB deci point is equal to 46. So this key ASCII is equal to 46. So go we'll here no letters, numbers, decimal point, no semicolon, no nothing, and then there's the backspace. Now, as some of you might have already figured out, you can always you can always just do it directly. Um, you can just delete this and then delete this and just type in directly 46. So you just go ahead and run the program again. And oh running program type in letters no numbers that's a yes symbols no but decimal point yes so either way works you can declare it as a uh, as a variable at the top in the general declarations or you can write it directly as key ASCII is equal to 46 okay so now that's pretty much uh, answers the question of try to believe here so if you want to make anything else exclusive, you just have to do the same process. You just go ahead and just type in key ASCII is equal to uh, 47 or whatever. So to, to know the values of these, uh, I forgot the OR. Always remember the OR. So it's OR and then OR, you can put as many ORs as you want in there. OR key ASCII is equal to 46. Now, if you want to know what these the values of these uh, numbers are, you have to find it in the, the internet, I guess. Um, this is a site I know, I use. It has a uh, key ASCII charts for zero to two twenty five, uh, two fifty five, and I'll put it into the description. Well, that's pretty much this tutorial. Thank you for watching.